Now it gives me great pleasure to announce the nominees for the 2012 Australia Day Citizen of the Year. And the nominees are Garth Harrigan, Anne-Marie Hislop, Arthur Payne, Professor AJ Rain, Abraham Saylor. If we could give them all a round of applause for the nominees. And the winner of the 2012 Australia Day Citizen of the Year goes to Garth Harrigan. A member of the National Seniors Townsville Branch, Townsville Region Committee on the Ageing, Managing Director and President of TOTS, Garth has been active in promoting community transport for seniors over the years including bikeways in Townsville, sun bus and wheelchair taxis. He has been an inspiration to the people who work with him. And we congratulate Garth for having his award today. Everything seems to be coming to an end because last year we were invited to a, um, a barbecue. Alan and I were invited to a barbecue out at uh, Brad Webb's. And part of the uh, session he said, come out and to me and talk to me. So I did. He said, now if you look around, you'll see I've just donated you a brand new four-wheel drive station wagon for tots. And that was that one. Now I get this one today, so I thank those. And of course, uh, Alan uh, was the uh, recipient last year for the other award. And he now uh, believes that he's no longer a Victorian. He's a Townsvilleite. So we've, we've, <laughs> we've educated him. And also, I'd like to thank all our, our 40 volunteers who keep uh, tots on the road because uh, we do look after about nearly 1,400 so very senior people, some uh, disabled and some uh, children. So uh, it's a, 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 a transport system, it's, it's a charity, it's not for profit, and we, uh, we do a great job there, I believe. We're now uh, into about the uh, sixth year, I think, into the seventh year, that we've been operating uh, and we're expanding quite late. But over those 34 years, I was first involved in the starting up of uh, Bikeways. And I was on, that, on the council on that one for 27 years. And after I left that, I got into TOTS and I've been doing that now, the transport part of that, for four, uh, the whole of the transport thing for 34 years. So it's been a long, long time, but I believe that we've now uh, made a, a major changes in Townsville's culture, not only in Townsville's culture, but Queensland and Australia, and that we've now accepted that community transport is a, is a middle uh, transport option between taxis and buses. And it looks after those people who just can't afford a taxi or get on to a walk to a bus stop or get on a bus. So both those are important things, and I'm only too proud to be able to initiate that back in 1989 and, uh, and have it carried forward with so many good volunteers. And some of those volunteers are past uh, premiers, uh, not premiers, uh, principals of uh, high schools and primary schools. We've got even a placement, some placement occasionally, and a whole host of others. We've even got the, uh, the boss of Yabula's wife. She comes in her Mercedes and does her a little bit too. So we've got everybody helping us these days and, and we'd love to have a lot more because volunteers, drivers are important. And uh, we work seven days a week and um, we work long hours. I think Alan gets out to about half past six or six o'clock or something and sometimes he knocks off at nine o'clock at night. So it's a long day for us. He's got a broken back, he shouldn't be walking around. Uh, I got cancer and I've had a heart bypass. So, you know, we carry on. So, we like to think that uh, we're doing something for the Townsville community, that even though we aren't really well, we'll do it and we enjoy doing it. Thank you very much. <laughs>